It was a shooting that shocked the community. Two brothers killed as they tried to arrest a man who jumped bail. Now, two years later, the shooter has agreed to a plea deal. 23 ABC's John Genovese joins us live from the neighborhood where this all happened with more. John. Amanda, this is the house where that shooting took place. Police say Brandon and Zach Sims were trying to arrest that bail jumper when another man, Stephen Stewart, opened fire. Now, both men were shot multiple times in and around the house. And according to a police report, one of the shootings was carried out execution style. But today in Superior Court, two first degree murder charges were dropped against Stewart. And in exchange, he pleaded no contest to two counts of voluntary manslaughter for a 38 year sentence. The brother's father, Vincent Sims, told us although he's, it's not what he had hoped for, it will finally bring his family some relief. It doesn't change my feelings every day that I have, you know, inside me that I think about and I go through. And, you know, I'll see my kids, my other kids, and how it hurts them. Um, it, it doesn't change all that, but it does take some of the pressure off of me knowing that it's going to be over soon. And sentencing in the case is scheduled for May 20th, but for now, Tim and Amanda, Vincent says he's still deciding whether or not to allow Stewart the opportunity to apologize to his family. Back to you.